Hey guys, how y'all doing? This is B and Paco with the Who That. We on the mothership again with another episode of the Who That Reviews. And we got us a smorgasbord of food right now. Smorgasbord. A smorgasbord. Smor Can you smell smorgasbord? Why don't you tell us where we get this food? <laughs> Smorgas. S C H M O R G E S B O R G. Smorgasbord. I can't spell it. it sounds here like we it. go. <laughs> So what we have here today is, this is a kitchen in the sky, okay? And this is a hidden gem that is down at the uh, the corner of James Campbell Boulevard and Santa Fe Pike. Yep. Okay, and this is food prepared by Dwayne Julius. Okay, he is the owner there of Kitchen in the Sky. And he's brought us a fish sandwich, um, we got some beef hot dogs. We got big these hot dogs out there. Beef hot dogs too. Thank you so much for the beef hot dogs. These right are on. African beef hot dogs. <laughs> yes. Yes. And so, we got the wings. Wings. Oh, wings. We got wings. Just give it half this and You won't. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, okay. Right cool. All right, so what we're gonna do first, I guess we're gonna try these uh, African beef hot dogs. <laughs> All right. Now, I haven't put anything on them these because I wanna be able dogs. to taste them and, you know, kind of see how they are. Yes. So, you wanna, you wanna start? Go ahead. Yeah, let's go, let's try it out. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's do some. And you slash it on it. I'm a mustard guy. This is the real test right here. <laughs> is it good with that racha? Mm -hmm. Now, the thing about Dwayne, Damn, he's good. got an actual smoker out there. Mm -hmm. So all his food is actually smoked. Mm -hmm. It's not any of that smoked liquid smoke or anything. It's actual smoked food. So, I mean, crushing that whole thing, ain't you? Bro. This is good. Yeah. yeah. All right, I'm just gonna take one more bite. Okay. We got As a guy who doesn't eat pork, this is a beef hot dog for him. He don't get a whole bunch of them. I don't. <laughs> I'm really appreciating this right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, this even holding a hot dog right now. This has been it's been months, probably a year since I've done this. Yeah. And that yeah. was with a chicken hot dog. All right. This beef hot dog is. This is where I'm about to go. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm. So I'm going to say, mm. man, I'm going to put some mustard on mine and crush mine in here in just a minute. All right. What, what's next? You yeah. want me? Okay. You want, I do the fish sandwich while you finish that. Mm -hmm. So we have a fish sandwich here. What's on? It looks like he's got some coleslaw, some hot sauce, some mustard, pickles, and this is catfish. Mm. And some onions. Yeah. You see that? Mm-hmm. So let me go ahead and do that. Anybody from the South, you know that this is called a deluxe right here. Let me put all what? the trimmings on. On, on my fish champion trimming. shirt, bro. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's all right, though. You got to pause with the thoughts. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's good, man. There's two layers of fish on here. Mmm. Okay. Yeah, so you get, a, you get your fish work. And I watched them. He fried these fillets, battered them, everything right here in front of me when I was... Uh, nice. When I was there picking it up. No. This is good. Okay, fish wise, it's not it's not too fried too hard. No. Um it's not fried too hard. That's one thing. It doesn't have you know how when you get fish and it's got like a little black to it and it's got kind of a mm -hmm. too much fish to it. I don't know. Yeah. I don't even know what that is. I'll I'll research that later. But it doesn't have that at all. It's good clean fish flavor. Mm, that's good. So that means he's buying quality meat at least, you know? Yes. Any bones? No. Now, anytime you get boneless fish, there's a possibility you might get a bone at some point in time. Right. Because of how they grind it up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It happens, but I mean, I haven't encountered a bone yet. Awesome. As long as it's not over fried. That's the only thing. Man, keep an eye on your fish when you fry it. Especially if you're selling fish sandwiches out here. Because some of y'all be selling me things that my back tooth and got cracked on. <laughs> <laughs> or the ratio of fish to breading. Oh, talk about it. Yeah. What about all right? So what's that one? Ratio good? Yeah, it's good, man. I mean, nice. you can take a look here. 
in the shot, and you can see the ratio. Mm -hmm. And now look at the fish. Mm -hmm. And you can see that. Mm -hmm. I like so that. It's not all braided. Mm -hmm. Two layers. Two layers of fish. That's what I'm talking about. Two Step big pieces. Fish, fish thing yep. game up. Now the only the only issue I occurred with this is before we brought it home and before production we let it sit in here too long and the bread got kind of mushy but that's our fault you know if you got go. this fresh and ate it you wouldn't incur that right. but that's our fault you know how it yeah. go you know how it go so other than that excellent excellent right. so right. what we got next here we got the wines <gasps> and that's is that a hot sauce or a barbecue sauce um, I think that's a barbecue. Just pick one, take your finger. Oh, yeah, that's a little, that's a little, that's a little spicy. Got a little tang to it. Mm-hmm. We got a little cake. Okay. But it's barbecue. Okay. Mm-hmm. Might be that smoke. That smoke, definitely. Mm-hmm. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. These aren't fried wings. These are smoke wings. Mm. So you can taste the grill in it. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yes, you can. Oh, he got something there. Mm-hmm. See, and I'm a, a wing connoisseur myself. Mm-hmm. I love some wings. But these right here, I gotta say, I'm loving this sauce. Mm-hmm. That's a good sauce. It's like a mixture of a hot sauce and a... Uh, I don't even want to put the sriracha on. Yeah. I'm saying though, yeah. you know me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I put sriracha, sriracha on everything. Everything. Just don't even eat the sriracha. So if you're tired of fried wings and you want to get you some smoked wings, Kitchen in the Sky. You definitely want to get you some smoked wings. And you can tell that this is organic because we ain't got nine napkin around. None. <laughs> None. This is a real deal. Just sticky fingers all day. All day. <laughs> mm. Now, when you go though, you want to make sure that gets you a good drink to pair it with. What's that you got right there, man? Okay. So you the reason I about. grabbed this drink, I'm a diabetic. This is a sugar-free, it's called Nature's Twist. They've got a couple different flavors, but it's sugar-free. And it's got a decent flavor. You're not gonna feel like you're just drinking another diet drink, okay? Thank God. Yeah. So, um, Nature's I mean, Twist I would, with some, I would with some pair them, wings. Um, no, I paired them wings there with some beer. Ah, <laughs> some all right. beer. Never mind, guys. <laughs> but this is good. I want to, like I said, I want to talk about this just because as diabetics, like even this Gatorade I have here is not good for me as a mm -hmm. diabetic. Mm -hmm. But the sugar free here, it's probably good. Look, I got sauce on it. Mm -hmm. It's real over here. Sticky fingers. It's real. It's real. We are really th reviewing this food. <laughs> this ain't like Food Network. This is real. The brand is called Nature's Twist. They have a couple different flavors. They got like a strawberry lemonade that's good and stuff. But it is sugar free, y'all. Diabetics, jump on that. Mm -hmm. We don't have a lot of choices out here. Mm -hmm. So, but yeah, this is a, he's got more than this. I'll put the menu up. Mm -hmm. I mean, he serves like a, a shrimp dinner he serves a lobster dinner and this is all out of the sky mart over there in the corner of james campbell and santa fe pike yes so make sure you check that out and he's i mean he's always now i do recommend if you are going to order make sure you call in mm -hmm. okay call it in so you can come in and you can pick it up yes. grab it and go yes so but yeah. So look it up, uh, get the number. Now, now keep on eating them because you know how you eat that one wing and it's good, then you get a one wing and it's kind of funny. I'm trying to eat it live right now. So if I come across one that's, that ain't that good, I can tell y'all about it. But so far, these smoked barbecue wings, man. Slide this half of the sandwich to the cameraman. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Feed your team, people. Feed your team. No, the other half. <laughs> <There you go. laughs> it's the other half. The other half. Yeah, no. I don't. I don't eat off that half. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. I, I'll feed you. Just don't eat off my plate. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Well, we're gonna finish because we're obviously enjoying our food. Right. Hope you go check out uh, Kitchen in the Sky. 
Make sure you stay looked out for uh, another episode of Who That Reviews. We'll be doing another one very, very soon. And if you know a local business or restaurant or someone that is, you know, doing their thing when it comes to food that can get some exposure or you think it just has some really, really good food that you want to see us try out, drop their name in the, uh, in the comments, tag them or, or share it with them or whatever mm -hmm. and hit us up and we'll try it out because I'm really enjoying this job. Right, right. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah. also, uh, make sure you subscribe to the page. It'll be down here somewhere. Like it up. Like Share it, it up. subscribe. Mm -hmm. Check out our merch store. And um, I think next week we're doing that Andrea's place. Yes, so food. Yes. Yeah. so yeah. we're definitely gonna check that out. And um, yeah. Y'all stay blessed. Don't stress, life is just a test. Find you something to where uh, you can start you a nice little business and eat for free. You know yeah. what I mean? Use your imagination. <laughs> All right, guys.